Having you back on the Coin Saris channel is a pleasure. Some shocking news that had somehow slipped my mind was revealed to me around three hours ago. My optimistic analysis on XRP went live little over an hour ago, and it's been doing well. By the way, I left this out because I had no idea about it. But, after the movie ended, I did start reading the comments area. If you're interested in watching the video, I've included a link to it at the bottom of this post. Notice what the subscribers are essentially claiming in the latest class action lawsuit. I have had a look at it and done some preliminary research on it. Additionally, I would like to briefly discuss with you my opinion on the matter and if I consider it to be significant. I was in a haste to get the video to you, so I'm sorry for the poor quality. Remember to take into account the critical factors that necessitate our consideration. Start with XR this is on CoinGape, and I can also provide you a link to it in the comment section here. Because we want you to give it your full attention and read it cover to cover. My attention span is too short to read it all. For your information, a new fact-based class action lawsuit has been filed against Ripple, challenging the company's handling of unregistered XRP offerings. In essence, they made the announcement today that they would be suing Ripple in the Northern District of California, claiming that the company had violated security requirements at the federal and state levels. Their previous scare tactics, including the allegation that Ripple sold unregistered securities, are quite comparable to this. The reason this is funny is because, she asserted last year that XRP is not a security. In response to these charges, the defendants from CoFENT and Ripple have argued that XRP is not a security and is therefore not required to be registered. Indeed, it is correct. It is the case as it pertains to the law. So, right now, all of their attention is on the institutional sales. Basically, that's about it for this burger. The worst case scenario would be that, in my opinion. I anticipate an increase in the amount of fines and trouble. Unfortunately, this bull run is just beginning to heat up, so that's bad news. Here we are at the early stages of coin season. Our performance for this year necessitates XRP. Because of this, it is just another unattractive look. Truth be told, I will tell you. It makes me feel bad. The next two days will be reserved for a more comprehensive analysis. Do not worry, this is not an emergency. Yet another annoyance. Therefore, I have shared my current knowledge with you. Put an X in the comment box if you would. After then, the video stops. Please subscribe to my channel, it would mean a lot to me. Thank you so much, leave.